guys, we're back again. Um, so I have been sick, and I can't believe I got sick again. Uh, in the last month or so, I think. Like this is like the second time I have been sick in the last either month or two. It's been horrible. And then obviously, along with that, I've had finals, and that's been really <coughs> slowing things down, excuse me, it's been really slowing things down for me. So, in an attempt to make that up, I'm trying to get through all of these as quick as I can. And by that I mean I'm trying to upload all of them uh, within this month. I am going to try and get it done before June, because I've been absolutely horrible with this. I wanted to upload, I wanted to make, like, two uploads a week when I uh, initially started this thing, but college got in the way, and then I got sick, and then I got sick again, which is right now. I'm still kind of getting over it, and, uh, you know, it's just been horrible overall. Like, this just, this couldn't have been, uh, any, timed any worse, you know, than, than what it is, but... It is what it is. So this part is incredibly short. It, it's it's going to be shorter than the other parts just because. Um, and this is going to be post. This is post commentary still. I'm going to admit that this is post commentary still. Um, <coughs> sorry if I. Oh my God. See, I'm still getting over this thing. But yeah, uh, I've always hated this part. I mean, this this uh, specific scene in the game, this this combat scene in the game, because it, it really is, this is probably like, I mean, it's not an infinite spawning uh, sequence at all, where enemies continually respawn, but it's just hard. That's all it is. It's just hard, because you're getting shot from every single angle possible, and if you're not careful, you can die, and you lose progress, and the checkpoint is really, you know, brutal here. And the goal is to kill the snipers, like that guy I just killed there. You're supposed to kill all the snipers, and then Elena, the scripted sequence that you hit, will come by and she'll save your ass. So, obviously that's what I'm trying to do here. I'm trying to kill the sniper as quick as I can with the foul. Um, so far it's working, but anything could go wrong at any time. And because this is Uncharted, and because the AI is... Uh, random and bullet damage is absolutely crazy. NC just like that, they they'll flank you and yeah, I died. Honestly, like any other time I played this part of the game, I haven't uh, I haven't died like that. Like I I did not die as much as I've died here. Maybe it's just because I haven't played played Uncharted 2's story in like a, in, in like a whole year since uh, this recording or something, but. I don't know. Maybe I'm also just used to Uncharted 3's uh, segments more because I was playing that more uh, recently. But be that as it may, be that as it may, I'm trying to also rush through this. I just want to get it done because it's it's not fun. This part is this is not a fun section of the game. It's really not. It's absolutely um, unenjoyable. Yeah, especially the especially the first time going through this. Sorry about that. Especially the first time going through this, it's a very unfun part of the game. And I don't know if Naughty Dog knew that at all or what. It's it's sort of a tense situation. Maybe that's on purpose. Probably is, because um, they want you to feel like you know Drake. I guess they want you to. Uh, feel that you, like you're tense, like him, like you're in this situation. I don't know. It's weird. Now, notice how I actually killed all the snipers, right? Okay, so Gal guys come by, and I just wait here, and for the scripted sequence to occur where Elena shows up, right? Okay. Um, something bullshit is about to happen. So I hold up like you're supposed to, to check when Elena is, and they threw a grenade into the car, of the, the, the train car. And I was too late to react to that, because I was too busy holding up on the D-pad, 
like an idiot. I know you're only supposed to just, I know you can only, you can ignore it if you want, or you can tap it, um, to whatever. I just wanted to do it to show you guys, uh, the little cutscene thing that they have, the nice little cinematic camera angle there when they, uh, you know, when you have it focused on the specific little cutscene there. That's all. Um, but that obviously backfired, so now we have to do this part again. And believe me, it's not fun. <laughs> uh, I try to go for quick kills here. I'm trying to let let the the foul shots, uh, you know, the recoil shoot up from the foul so I can get their heads and kill them uh, quickly. But it's not easy because there's all these guys shooting you when you're poking your head out of cover, and and now there's this guy here, and I stupidly. Stupidly try to melee him, and th th and then I got what I you know paid for there. He shotgunned me through the fucking wall. Excuse my language, sorry, <laughs> but that's what that's what happened. And now we're doing it again, and I'm just at this point in time, I just feel so annoyed. I just feel like, oh, I don't want to play this now. I'm so freaking tired of this. Just let me get through it. I had it right there, the first that second time, but I screwed it up by holding up on the D-pad, not paying attention, or listening for the grenade sound. No, I was an idiot. I was a freaking idiot and just decided to do something incredibly stupid. And there I go, dying again. You know, uh, oh, here we are again, the fifth time. So I just was, I, I, I completely lost focus by this point in time. Uh, it wasn't, <sighs> believe me. Believe me, guys. Did not have fun with this. I did not. I was absolutely, positively reminded why I, I I hate this chapter in the game. So freaking dumb. Ugh. You know, Uncharted 3 hit does not have a situation like this at all, and that's why uh, that's probably one of the reasons why it's so replayable is because there isn't an annoying situation like this in the game where they just throw you into this one spot and it literally is a cover shooter. It literally is. Like, this this chapter is literally a cover shooter. <coughs> this train yard is literally a cover shooter section. By the way, excuse me again. Goodness, I'm burping like crazy, but... Yeah, it's just literally... A cover shooter right here. I mean, I talked about in the last videos how Uncharted is more than a cover shooter. But here we are. They're using their cover mechanics to do what it essentially is a cover shooter situation. Where you're just hiding behind cover and shooting guys. And that's probably the most boring and frustrating things in this game. Period. Sorry just is. Just really, really boring. And so now we finally, finally get this, the Gao uh, enemies to show up again. The, I guess the people call these guys the mutants or something. I don't know. I, I don't know. I just call them Gao guys, okay? Because GAU, they're holding the Gatling gun, machine guns. And so I purposefully put myself behind the full cover wall so I don't have to worry about um, a grenade randomly flying into my direction to kill me. And so you finally got to see the full cinematic angle there, and we're done with this chapter. Um, so I will leave it at that. Enjoy the cutscene. See you in the next part, guys. Later.